man is always on a mission to bag a bargain. And today, the Bank of Dave is sharing more of his money-saving secrets. He's got the haggling hacks you need if you're on the hunt today for a new car. Of the seven million second-hand cars sold every year in the UK, approximately 650,000 are sold at auction. Most car auctions are trade only, but some let private buyers in. Now, 10% of the cars sold at these auctions are sold to private buyers. Look at that. That's probably 50,000 quid worth of car when it were new. Seven or eight years ago. It sold for 1,500 quid. What a lot of car for your money. That's a bargain. But is there an auction bargain for you? Let's find out. If you could... Save with Dave! I've been working in the motor industry for over 30 years and I'm now the largest supplier of minibuses in the UK. So I felt very at home when I visited Letchworth Motor Auctions. What are the pros at buying from an auction? The main pro for buying from an auction is that you will save yourself a lot of money from buying off a retail forecourt. What about the downside? The downside is if you're buying an auction, you're, you're treated as a trade buyer. There is no guarantee with those cars. Prior to coming, to do your homework. Look online, all our cars are displayed on the website. You look at your mobile phone onto Auto Trader or some such thing and get a retail value, back the retail value off to a, a trade figure, which could be £1,200 less depending on what you're buying, and stick to that figure. Most auctions are open early, so you can look over the cars. When you come to the auction, we have two types of declarations on the cars. Sold us with a trial or sold us seen. Sold a trial, we've done a 45 point inspection check on it, and then we do a 10 mile road test, basically a health check. Any thoughts that arise from us checking the vehicle, we will declare for you. Not every auction house will offer that to you. With the sold or seen, you are on your own. Whenever you're buying a second hand car, pull the handbrake up, see how far it'll go up. If it goes up here, you know the thing's been used and used hard. Here are some checks you might find useful. We want to be looking down all the gaps where you can put your finger. If they've had a big bump, usually it's very difficult for them to be able to get them gaps right. Look at that big knob there. That is an automatic gearbox for a fortune to fix. And if you're buying an old vehicle, that's something to think about. If something's leaking, it's a little bit like a person. If you're leaking blood, you've got a problem. If a car engine or a van engine's leaking oil, water or gearbox oil, you've got a problem. So we're going to have a right good look underneath. There. Boom. Four splodges of oil. That tells you there's a huge problem with this vehicle. I'd now not buy this car. It's about to start. It's really, really exciting. Paddy 800 pound bid, 800 pounds in the boot. Well, eight... The auction will have bids from online and in the room. 850 bid. Including members of the trade. What kind of mistakes do people make when they come to an auction? They get overexcited and the bidding runs away with them and they end up paying too much money. You need to have a level that you will go to and when it reaches that, stop. So get a feel for the auctions by visiting before you bid. You don't want to be catching nodding dog syndrome. Uh, definitely not. <laughs> you will need ID, deposit and purchase fees. And finally... We will also print an HPI check-off for you. So that's super important for the viewers at home. And you're buying from somebody in the street, you can go online, it'll cost you up to a tenner. HPI, that registration, it'll tell you if it's been bumped, financed, damaged, on fire. Super important. My biggest tip of the night, HPI the vehicle before you buy it. Now I've bought thousands of vehicles at auction, but I've never been an auctioneer until tonight. We're in your hands, Dave. Yeah. <laughs> I think you're going to love it. OK, everybody, a very, very good evening. Give us a big wave. Hey, look at that 2011 Ford Fiesta Z. And the first bid is in. We've actually got an online bid immediately at 325. Let's 25. see if we can get that up. 375 there, sir. Thank you very much. What do you think about my auctioning skills? Well, actually, I think they were happy until... I think you got overexcited. We've notified the lawyers already. Until I had my genius idea. Listen, whoever buys that car, we're going to chuck in that McLaren there at the side. You can't go giving away 50 grand cars with a £1,000 <laughs> Who's going to give me 600? But just when I thought the bidders were having a fiesta, siesta, there you go, 700 quid to Russ. That was great fun. First time ever I've been an auction here. And you weren't shy, anything but. Hope you've got some good tips. We'll see you again very soon. Ta-ra, everybody.